Ladies and gentlemen, Trump Kennedy 2024. Reports are coming out that Trump's team has contacted Kennedy's team and said, will you serve on the ticket? Now, if you're a MAGA conservative Republican like myself, Kennedy is not your first choice. We got Ben Carson. We got Kerry Lake. We got a few others. We got General Flynn. But you need to be very strategic. This is the most important election in American, if not world history. That's number one. Number two, we need we need to make sure with the machines and everything else, we need every vote we can get. Yes, we have all the people, but are we going to get all the votes? Those who know, they know. Now, so you want to get the independents and the Democrats that are just tired of the Democrat Party. Kennedy's doing great with them. Let's get right into this article. There we go. Good news. We called it. President's tree, President Trump's team has reportedly reached out to Bobby Kennedy Jr. about serving as vice president. Wouldn't write it off. According to John Levine at the New York Post, President Trump has reached out to baby Bobby Kennedy Jr. about serving as his vice president. Desperate times call for drastic measures. Recent polling posted at Real Clear Politics confirms that a Trump Robert Kennedy Jr. ticket would win over 60% of the vote. Joe Biden would be a distant second and would suffer the historic loss he deserves. Today, America is at a crossroads. There is only one man who can lead us back to our foundation, to law and order, to a rational foreign policy, to a thriving country that respects its borders. As the Gateway Pundit reported last week, if President Trump needs to take on Robert Kennedy Jr. to ensure a united win in November, then he should not hesitate to make it happen. People close to former President Trump made preliminary overtures to Robert F. Kennedy about the possibility of serving as his running mate. The Post has learned. Trump operatives expressed an interest in Kennedy early on, but it was all premature, said one person familiar with the matter, adding that it was, quote, right out of the box when Bobby announced in April 2023. <clears throat> now, Kennedy started running as a Democrat. Then he saw what the Democrats are doing. See, the Democrats are saying that Trump threat to democracy, but it was the Democrats who said, no, yeah, you might want to run as a Democrat and you're polling at over 20% against the incumbent, but you're not going to debate him. You're not going to come near him. Not only that, you're not invited to the RNC. Not only that, the media is going to bash you. Oh, and when your life is threatened, we're not going to give you secret service which has never been done in the history of our country. Do you know that if someone is pull, polling at 10%, they usually get Secret Service? But Biden refused to give Kennedy Secret Service to protect him, even after his life was already threatened multiple times, and he was polling at, a, I believe, like 25% against Biden. So who's a threat to your so-called Democracy, we're a constitutional republic. Get that right. But then they said, you're not going to debate. Then they said, you're not even going to be on the ballot. If people want to vote for you, they have to write you in. So Kennedy was left with no option but to withdraw from running as a Democrat and is running as an independent. Now, he's doing amazingly well among independents. He's doing fantastically well among independents. Now, <clears throat> I think for strategic, out of a strategy way, Trump needs to bring on Kennedy. Kennedy is anti-establishment. He's anti-CIA and FBI. Obviously, the swamp, the uniparty, the far-left extremists, don't like him. The media doesn't like him. 
they're terrified of his family. I mean, they had to, his uncle and his father. I like them just for that. Those are enough. Yeah, we don't agree on many things. At the end of the day, he's got a lot of Democrat values that I disagree with 150%. But when it comes to the swamp, we need to remember before the abortion problem, before anything else, we need to take care of the swamp problem, the Uniparty, the CIA, that fourth branch of government that runs everything. They need to be dealt with. And I believe Trump and Kennedy together, we saw what the, what the, how they've been treating the Kennedys. We see how they've been treating the Trumps. Trump, Kennedy, take down the swamp. I, come on, prove somebody. Prove, prove me wrong. That there is a worst case scenario for the swamp and the Uniparty if it's not Trump and Kennedy who. Now, once the swamp is taken care of and they stop dividing our country using the media, then we can get things done and get things fixed, resolved, and issues settled. But yeah, ladies and gentlemen, I'll keep you in the loop. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share. Hit that bell notification so you're notified every time I upload Trump 2024 or sooner.